Just when you thought Intel had reasserted its performance desktop crown, Apple comes swinging back with a potent new challenger, the M4 chip. Recent Geekbench entries reveal the Cupertino company's latest ARM processor demolishing Intel's vaunted Core i9-14900KS in single-threaded performance. Could Apple's M4 be the chip that finally makes Mac desktops undeniably faster than Windows PCs? Let's take a look. Apple made some lofty claims about the M4's performance prowess at its spring launch event. But the chip is backing it up with some jaw-dropping Geekbench scores that put Intel's heavyweight desktop chip on notice. Clusters of results showing roughly 3,800 points in single-core tests have begun populating the popular benchmark's online database. To put that into perspective, Intel's range-topping Core i9-14900KSA power-hungry processor aimed at extreme desktop gaming rigs tops out at around 3,300 points in single-threaded work. That means the M4 is outpacing Intel's latest and greatest by a staggering 16% margin in this critical area of CPU performance. The massive single-core gains could stem from Apple's embrace of new scalable matrix extensions, SME, technology and the M4. While aimed at accelerating AI and machine learning workloads, SME gives the M4 an inherent advantage in certain Geekbench test categories like object detection and image processing. We're likely seeing the peak of what's possible, but it's nevertheless an incredible accomplishment for an ultra-efficient ARM chip designed for mobile devices. As exceptional as the M4 is in single-core testing, Intel still reigns supreme when it comes to heavily multi-threaded workloads. The 14900KS and its 32 threads simply outmuscle the M4's 10 cores. Of course, gaming desktops are where Intel's latest chip will shine brightest. For prosumer creative workloads that scale across many cores too, Intel's deep reserves give it an undeniable edge on the high-end desktop. That said, the M4's more modest multi-core gains over the prior M2 are still enough to handle most productivity tasks with relative ease. Apple's custom silicon remains orders of magnitude more efficient than power-hungry x86 rivals from Intel and AMD. But this new chapter in the Apple vs. Intel battle is shaping up as a give and take rather than complete domination by either side. While the Geekbench numbers are undoubtedly impressive, they only tell part of the M4 performance story. Apple made some ambitious claims about this chip taking mobile computing to new heights. During its lavish keynote, the company boasted of the M4 providing a 50% multi-threaded performance uplift over the mount to. It also bragged about the new chip delivering performance comparable to an Intel Core i7U series laptop chip while using just a quarter of the power. Essentially, the M4 is being positioned as a veritable efficiency monster. A true game-changer in giving tablets and ultra-portable laptops access to genuine desktop-caliber processing muscle without decimating battery life. Between its 28 billion transistors, 10-core CPU complex, 10-core GPU, and souped-up 16-core neural engine for AI ML acceleration, it could fulfill that bold promise. This combination of potent CPU, GPU performance with AI, ML specialization is what really separates the M4 from Intel's latest wares. While the 14900KS is undoubtedly a heavyweight in raw x86 computing, the trend lines are bending toward heterogeneous architectures and workload-specific acceleration. 
Apple's unified memory architecture and ability to task-optimize its myriad processor engines could make the M4 remarkably future-proof despite its less extreme x86 multi-core showing. Whichever way you slice it, the M4 results prove Apple is now a legitimate alternative to Intel's performance desktop chips. The company's custom silicon has essentially caught up in single-threaded performance and elevated mobile productivity to unprecedented heights. But this isn't a one-sided thrashing either. There are clear dividing lines in areas like multi-threaded workloads, gaming, and extreme pro workstation needs that still favor Intel's hardware flexibility and support for desktop-grade GPUs. While exciting, the M4 also isn't a generational revolution like Apple's earth-shattering M1 debut. In the end, customers with diverse computing needs ultimately benefit from increased competition at the high end between these two titans. Apple put Intel squarely back on notice this spring the performance desktop crown is still very much up for grabs. Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below and thanks for watching.